Hello from the London Stadium and the weather gods have been kind to us. It's a sunny day in this part of the English capital. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's West Ham United versus Arsenal. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. Well, as you can see, they're playing with a diamond in midfield, which allows them to dominate the central area, but does leave them exposed out wide. And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Well, it's a 4-3-3 with two out-and-out -out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. And now they get the ball rolling. Well read to put an end to that attack. Lokonga. Martin Odegaard. Saka. It's a perfect challenge. Antonio. Oh, managing to beat him. Making sure it didn't get past him. Rice. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. Played over, and he clears the danger. Saka, and well, he was in the right place to intercept. Masuaku, space and time for the cross. Not showing good patience. And there's the feed into the box. The referee is given a corner. <laughs> Can he deliver it with accuracy? It didn't happen for them. Happy to take on the shot. A oh, good hit, close shave. Martin Odegaard. Lacazette well, couldn't find a teammate unfortunately and a throw in to come Said Benrama 
Perfectly positioned to take it away. Lacazette. Gabriel Martinelli. Now Lacazette. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Good pressure high up the pitch. Might jump in front. Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. Playing it in. Well, not quite the corner he had in mind. Goalkeeper has it. Well, not hard to read that pass. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Gabriel. Ben White. Kurt Zuma. And that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Declan Rice. Antonio. Well, that's one for them to pursue. Press well. Antonio. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Let's see about the delivery. And a fine stop. Lacazette. Saka. And the pass, a good one. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Lacazette prepared to fire. And they deal with the threat this time. Well, he's given it away. Gabriel Martinelli. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Granit Xhaka and with that the attack fizzles out Ben Rama Rice with it side Ben Rama now do they mean business on this occasion and let's give credit to the defending Albert Sambi Lokonga Cedric Shot attempted. Well, the keeper committed himself. And over comes the corner. Still not clear. And with that, the first half draws to a close. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Bukayo Saka. 
Cedric. Saka. It's with Erdogan. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. And the cross is very much on. Fluency of movement. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Aaron Cresswell. And a pass that lacks quality. Lokonga. Now Lacazette. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. Lacazette. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Credit to them for winning back possession. Craig Dawson. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Cedric. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. And there it is, 1-0. Their efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Well, as you can see, he gets a touch on this, but it's not quite enough to stop the goal. It was a good effort, though. Well, the action underway once again, and the onus is on West Ham to find a response now. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Cedric. It's with Erdegaard. Marcinelli. And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. So a personnel change then. Jared Bowen. Antonio. Said Benrama. And he's in. Oh, good save. Playing it in, and under pressure, not on the target. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. Andrei Yarmolenko now. Really vital interception here. Into the final 20 minutes. Granit Xhaka. Ben White. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. And a chance to whip it in here. Granite Jacker. Will he find the net? Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it.
Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, he failed to get it away properly. And a timely intervention. He's beaten his man. Martinelli. And Ketia. Superb block. Corner to Arsenal. What can they do with this one? So making the substitution now. Number seven, Mikhail Saka, to be replaced by number 19, Nicholas Pepe. Can someone get on the end of this? It hasn't come to very much. Pepe. The defender doing his job. Now oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. Well, time is running out for West Ham and their fans are demanding more urgency. They've got to get the ball into the box and make things happen. Kessia, is it going to be? But a crucial intervention inside the box. Over the touchline for a throw in. Lokonga. Marcinelli. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Yarmolenko. Declan Rice. Well, do they have a goal in the future? They're giving it a go. A really top-notch piece of defending. And the referee has decided to add on a minimum of five minutes. And that is offside. Gabriel. Martinelli Lokonga Martin Odegaard Albert Sambi Lokonga Really getting stuck in The whistle for full time and a bad day at the office as far as West Ham are concerned What did you think of their overall performance? Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed. Well, I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent, and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.